Here with Pat Santoro after Lehigh beats uh, Princeton 34 to three. You also beat Ryder earlier in the day. Can you talk about the team's performance and some of the challenges you're facing with the travel during the day and just? No, that's not an issue. Not so. Travel not okay. issue. We're so close. Yeah, well, that was not the. Yeah, I think overall I thought our guys wrestled. I think about in 20 matches. I think we had really good effort about. Yeah. On the losing end a couple times, and we were the aggressors. You know, matches earlier today. Yep. Uh, two of them, we weren't the aggressors. That's why we lost. Uh, today, I thought we, were, we came out. They wrestled much better in the second match. They were more aggressive. Way more. Yeah. And, and, and part of maybe we need a better warm up. We'll have to figure that out. But uh, they, this is consistent. Second match or first match or we both? Were, no, this match we were much more aggressive. Okay. okay. No, but the warm up specifically yeah, before Ryder. Yeah. I mean, okay. I thought we had a good one, but maybe not. Maybe it was a morning match. Uh, yeah. But you can have morning matches in the NCAA tournament. Definitely. You, know, you had to be waiting. So you got to be ready all the time. Right. Not an excuse because the other guys in the same boat. These guys, um, you know, Princeton had a, a lot of fight for being dominated by you guys. No, Princeton has a really good team. They have a couple guys out. I mean, obviously, the yeah. two of the you know, stars are out of line. Right. That makes a difference. But Princeton has a really good team. Uh, Chris Harris is doing a great job with their team. And they're going to be a team to be reckoned with by the end of the night. Every week they're getting better, you can see. Definitely. Can you talk about Mason Beckman coming back in the lineup? Yeah, you know, it's just one of those things. We had to make sure he was healthy 100%. We wanted to wait. Um, we thought he was ready, he wasn't. So we waited, waited. And, you know, I think he started to get his feet moving a little bit. Felt better, I think, overall, and he started trusting himself that last match. Nice. And uh, can you tell us a little bit about Wessel's his injury, or you just want to get no, Valaro? He got, he got cut up really bad and deep, and it was one of those that has to be inside and outside stitches. Oh, so no he, kidding. He had no place to do it initially, so we didn't have time to get him fixed up. Gotcha. Okay. But Doug, we have a lot of faith in Doug. He's really good. Good, good pin at the end of the, or yeah, take down at the end of the match, sudden Donald's victory. A really talented. We had two big wins last weekend. Yeah. He's really good. Good guy. Yeah. All right. Thanks, coach. Thanks.